We've all been waiting years for this day to come. Paul and I have been best friends since the day I was born. And in all honesty, being the younger sister of this amazing person has been a true highlight of my life. Paul's brilliant. He's a human calculator who actually enjoys doing complex math equations. Paul's patient and kind. I call Paul on my way home from work almost every day. He's willing to listen to me complain or celebrate the small wins I want to share with him. But the thing I admire most about my brother is his authenticity. Paul is 100% himself 100% of the time. Look at that suit. <laughs> Paul doesn't care what other people think of him. I believe Paul's ability to show up as he is always allows him to accept others as they are. And Paul loves Megan unconditionally and accepts her for exactly who she is. And that is a beautiful thing. Megan and I, it's always us against them, regardless of who the them is. Basically, all of my fashion sense ability to sort of do makeup and music taste is because I had a cool, brave sister unfearfully willing to speak her truth. I have always wanted a brother. I got lucky with Paul because thus far he is the only family member to not make me cry while teaching me math. Paul was always very patient. All that I've ever wanted in anybody is to be patient, kind, and forgiving and that's exactly what Paul was even with something so small like doing math homework which he always helped me with and I love that Paul when I met you I knew there was something different about you but couldn't figure out what it was unbeknownst to me I had met my soulmate you have loved me unconditionally and in doing so you have given me the space to be myself, to grow as an individual, and to make mistakes while learning and growing with me. I truly feel like I can accomplish anything with you by my side, and I'm so excited to continue our adventure. People say the grass is always greener on the other side, but you are my green grass. Megan. Over the past nine years, we have been building a life together. We laugh together, cry together, and are growing together. You already know that I have loved you since the moment you rented Transformers 3 from Redbox, and now I am telling you I plan on loving you for the rest of my life. We started in the basement apartment and now have our very own tiny house with two beautiful cats. I am overjoyed at the idea of creating our forever home together for however many cats the future may bring us. <laughs> Even though it took eight years to get you to watch Vampire Diaries, I'm excited to see what shows I can get you to watch next. I can't wait to love, cherish, and support you and all of the cats forever. <laughs> Today, I don't feel like I'm losing a sibling. I do feel like I am gaining one. And I'm very grateful for that because I've always wanted a brother. Probably one who pays me more than five bucks an hour to clean their room. <laughs> I'm going to end this with a song lyric, one of my favorite songs. I just miss standing next to you wearing matching dresses before the world was big. While growing up, Paul and I looked so similar that people often mistook us for twins. Even now, if I grew a nice neck beard, <laughs> we'd probably be the same person. Looking like Paul has never been a problem for me because I wanted to be just like him. Even now, I want to be more like Paul. 
Megan's very passionate about things she believes in, and one of the things she believes in most is my brother. Megan is Paul's biggest fan. She loves him for who he is, including all of his weird quirks. She may not enjoy his vast Lego collection or inability to make any decision ever, but she still loves him as he is. Paul and Megan complement each other well. Megan's strong personality pushes Paul to get out of his comfort zone, which we all know is their house. And Paul's laid back, easygoing personality reels Megan back in when she's going off on a tangent about social injustice or her favorite kind of rocks. They complete each other in their own way. So, Megan, welcome to the family, and I wish you both happiness in your marriage and life. Yeah.